the international criminal court is currently investigating allegations of war crimes and serious human rights abuses by all parties to the conflict in afghanistan including the taliban taliban commanders who knew or should have known about abuses by forces under their control and took no action to prevent or stop them are culpable as a matter of command responsibility human rights watch said in kandahar the taliban have been detaining and executing suspected members of the provisional government and security forces and in some cases their relatives activists in kandahar said that in villages surrounding the provisional capital taliban commanders have detained scores of people associated with the government or police in one case on july 16 taliban fighters abducted two men whose brothers had worked with nds3 a cia backed strike force that has been responsible for summary executions and other abuses from their homes in Kazimpur area then district their relatives say that they have not heard from the two men since also in mid july a report said taliban fighters detained ahmedullah a former police officer in spinboltak his family has not heard from him since his uncle said that the taliban had sent letter saying that anyone who had worked with the government or foreign forces would be harmed so long as they reported to the taliban leadership among recent cases the taliban executed a popular kandahari comedian nasir mohammed known as qasas swan taliban forces apparently executed qasas swan because he poked fun at taliban leaders said patricia gosman associate judicia director at human rights watch his murder and other recent abuses demonstrate the willingness of taliban commanders to violently crush even the tamest criticism or objection advancing taliban forces have no blank check to brutally target their critics gosman said the taliban leadership usually denies the abuses but it is their fighters carrying out these attacks and their responsibility to stop the killings international humanitarian law prohibits summary executions enforced disappearances and other mistreatment of anyone in custody which are war crimes it is unlawful to detain civilians unless absolutely necessary for imperative security reasons retaliatory attacks are a form of collective punishment and are also prohibited news desk comedy english <laughs> <laughs>